Hey y'all, this is Dollface Trucker checking in with you guys. Um, I just read a comment that was super disturbing to me. I almost went off the chain for this comment because it bothered the hell out of me. Normally, I don't care about comments or what trolls say or what supporters say or whatever constructive criticism people give me but this person got it totally wrong part of the comment was I seem like the person that will curve a dude but I will friend a, a female without even knowing her and that I would probably only talk to somebody who does YouTube or somebody who can benefit me for what they have that is totally wrong I have never been that type of person and I never will be that type of person. And here's why. Growing up, my mom was a gold digger. She would not date a man unless he had good credit and money and she can get some of his money. I hated that about her. That's what she did with her life and fine, but I am totally not that person. I've dated multi-millionaires and they wanted to pamper me and buy me things and fly me around the world and you know I will be living my best life however there comes a, a risk with that it's not all reward they want to own me they want to control me they want to act like because they're giving me their money or their material possessions that they own me I did it before with a man who was a celebrity I can't name his name because I signed a non-disclosure agreement but I realized very early on as like in my early 20s, that's not the type of woman I want to be. I can care less what the fuck a man got. I don't care if you have a thousand dollars, a million dollars, no savings account, multi-billion dollar industry. I don't care. You want to know why? Because what matters is what's inside. I make my own money. I don't ask people for money. I don't have my hand out. I work for everything that I have and everything that I want. You would never ever hear a man that has been taking care of me ever. I don't care. I'm the type of person that I work hard for what I have. And yes, I would want a man to match me as far as our jobs or our careers or our financial situation. <coughs> Excuse me. But if he doesn't, fine. You want to know why? Because as long as he's striving to be better, I'm cool with that. I've dated a man that was a multi-billionaire, and I've dated a man who didn't even have a job. He was a felon, and he couldn't even get a job. I don't care. As long as you are striving to be a better you tomorrow than you are today. As long as you're not being complacent. As long as you want to be a better person and, and grow. As long as you're not happy with just staying at McDonald's forever and that's the career you're going to have I don't want that kind of man I want a man who wants to be a better version of himself and it's constantly evolving that means if he starts out with no money and he's broke and I have money cool and if he but if he's willing to evolve into something better cool that's what I want if you already got it and you're rich and you got money I probably won't fucking date you that will probably be the dudes that I curve because I'm not like that average chick that only want a man for what he got. I can care fucking less because I ain't work for that money. That's not my money. I didn't work for it. And I would never, ever, ever let a man tell me you wouldn't have that if it wasn't for me. Fuck that. I got everything I got because of me, not because of a man, because of me. So to the person who made that comment, you should try getting to know me first before make, passing judgment on what type of female I come across as. A lot of people judge me based on what I they see me as, what I come across as. But when they get to know me, they're like, no, you're not even nowhere near the type of chick I thought you were. I thought you were stuck up. I thought you were unapproachable. I thought you were this and that. But you're totally not that. You're t the most down-earth, caring, friendly person I ever met. So why don't you try getting to know me first before passing judgment on me if I choose not to date a dude it's because and he tries to talk to me it's usually the, the number one reason why I curb any dude or any female is because I am not attracted to them visually 
physically. Physically to me, I will not, I'm not attracted to them. Meaning, I can't be with somebody that can treat me well and 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 treat me like a queen, but I, I won't even get horny being with them because I'm not attracted to them. It sounds shallow, but it's the truth. I can't help that. Just I because I know me and I like beautiful things. I like to see I like I want to be attracted to my spouse. So if I'm not attracted to you and I'm with you and you treat me like a queen, that's not enough. Because if I'm seeing somebody else, if they walk past or they try to get my attention, I'm gonna be wondering, like, dude, he's or she's cute. So I don't want to do that with my person, with my spouse. When I'm with my person, I want my eyes to be the only eyes for him or her. I don't want to be wander, have wandering eyes. And that's probably the only reason why I would curve a dude or a female. And he don't got to be the finest dude in the world. I like all types of people. You could be black, white, skinny, short, fat, tall. I don't care. It just has to be something about you that's attractive to me. When I say I like attractive people, that doesn't mean you got to look like a supermodel. I don't care about that. So you need to check your biases at the door and understand the type of female I am before you make any judgment. Because when you say stuff like that on my channel, on my comments, that's, that's low-key slander. And I don't need none of that bad press. I'm trying to build a brand. And... I have to defend my brand and that's the reason why I'm making this video because I'm not about to have nobody sitting up here saying what type of person they think I am or I come across as as if you have met me before. Everybody who has met me from YouTube say the same thing. I'm a cool person. And if I am a cool person and I met you, put a comment below and say how cool I am. Because I don't I don't need no slander. I don't need none of that. I'm trying to build a brand. And if you haven't met me and you have a comment about me about who you think I am or the type of personality I might have or whatever character traits you think I might have, why don't you just put that on the side and try getting to know me? You might find something out. Have a good night.